the luggers uh, Ben and Nev on uh, Samuki. There's Suzuki Bandit on this Friday afternoon. Um, it's about 25, quite pleasant compared to what we've had recently. Uh, we had a bit of a heat wave, that's why I haven't been on. Um, I think it was about 10 to 12 days, I can't quite remember, but it was just too hot to ride. <coughs> so, um, couldn't make any videos, of course. But uh, the last couple of days has been a bit better. Um, a lot more pleasant, a lot more rideable weather. Um, I believe it's still going to get up to about 30 anyway soon, so the hot, hotter weather, hottish weather, has not gone away as yet. Um, not uncommon for this time of year. Um, getting a um, bit of a whirly wind there. And another one there, Jesus. <laughs> Well, there's something, isn't it? Fucking whirly wind. <laughs> That'd have to be a first. <laughs> Go through a whirly wind. <laughs> Gee, did you see it? Take that, uh, take that bin. Crikey! <laughs> I got no idea what that was all about, but <laughs> it's good to have a full face helmet on anyway. Um. Yeah, that was very unexpected. There it is, just up there. <laughs> Hasn't gone away yet. <laughs> very strange. Anyway, where was I? Yeah, the weather. Yeah, the weather hasn't been great. Um, but today, last couple of days have been a lot better. Um, which is good. Not long before football starts, today week the football starts, my local SANFL side will have its first game. I've been told that we're not going to do that well this year, but who knows. <coughs> um, have to wait and see, won't know any more until about halfway through the, through the season to see where we are. So anyway, um, what do I have for you? Well, as you can see, I've still got the um, um, temperature gauge, the digital temperature gauge still going. Um, at one stage, it wasn't going. Um, was having a lot of trouble with the uh, adapter that uh, goes on the hose, on the, um, well, the radiator hoses or whatever you call it just underneath the tank here the adapter <coughs> uh, was leaking all the time um, so uh, I'll put a picture up and show you it was leaking from the top where the um, the sensor goes in and uh, so I decided all right I'll uh, I'll put a I'll put a uh, aluminium washer on it so I did that, and uh, nah, that that didn't make any uh, any difference at all. So this is the third time I'd uh, rinse the uh, or take taken out the uh, coolant, and um, replaced it. The first time I just drained it and put new coolant in. Uh, after that, I just tipped it into a clean container and uh, reused it because it's not exactly cheap but anyway um, I've, I've done that about three times and uh, I spoke to my friend at the bike shop and he said look bring it in and uh, I'll have a go at putting um, some more heaps of uh, what do you call it uh, plumber's tape around it. Uh, he not only did plumber's tape, but he also did, uh, he found a washer that was a little bit small, but filed it so it fitted a lot better than the washer I had on it, the aluminium washer. And also, um, I believe he used an O-ring. 
So um, I've been checking it and checking it and checking it and uh, there is no leak. Um, touch wood and hopefully it won't. It won't leak. So um, in the meantime before I uh, put that hose back on with the uh, temperature gauge um, adapter I had another hose that I bought a set of um, silicon hoses from China so I used one of them in the meantime and um, it sufficed it did a good job um, until I uh, got the uh, the hose uh, fixed you can you can see uh, in the picture I put up I'll put up um, that I used some uh, emergency tape because the hose had a bit of a oh, I don't know a bit of a scar in it so I just used that and put it back on for the time being and uh, I've got a spare hose if need be um, see how long it lasts I'll know straight away if, if it starts leaking I'll be able to smell the uh, the coolant because that's how I knew the um, the adapter was leaking so anyway hopefully that's fixed um, I've recently um, upgraded my uh, NBN to a faster NBN um, it just happened today uh, and it's because what they've done they've actually dropped the prices here um, a fair bit for the uh, faster MBN on the 20th of March so I thought well I might as well uh, might as well do it why not it's actually costing me nothing extra per month so why not So yeah, um, I'm on a, a fair bit faster NBN. Um, I did a, a speed test and it was 360 uh, download and 50, 50-ish upload. So yeah, it's definitely, uh, it's definitely working. Um, I did want the ultra fast but I only got the super fast because they said that my modem won't handle the ultra fast so I'm happy with what I've got I'm happy with that and it's not actually costing me any more uh, there is a bit of a saga to it, to that story but um, basically I, I, I was going to change to iinet which is um, a sister company to um, Internode anyway um, but they said uh, not to worry about it uh, well, you're, a value, you're a valued customer you're a valued customer and um, we want you to stay with Internode even though they're not taking any more uh, new customers they said you're a valued customer and we want to keep you and I said, all right, no worries. And they're the ones who found out that the modem wasn't real, really compatible with the ultra-fast speed. So, and I don't want to buy another modem. I'm happy with the one I've got. So, yeah, um, I've got heaps faster internet now. I was on NBM 100, but now I'm on something even faster. <laughs> and um, I'll know a bit more when uh, I upload this video if it has uh, if it uploads quicker um, doing the rendering on YouTube won't won't be any quicker that would just take as long as it normally takes but the actual getting the actual file up or the video up it uh, might be a bit quicker so yeah um, I, li I like the speed because I do a lot of uh, YouTube watching I stream a lot Prime MGM and um, what's the other one? Paramount, yeah. 
Prime, Paramount and MGM I've got. So I do stream a fair bit. And uh, yeah, so that's what I've been up to. If I think any think about anything else that I can add to uh, to everything, I'll uh, I'll put it in here. If not, this is uh, Bandit Nev on the way to the shop, bidding you all very, very, very safe riding. And uh, until next time, cheers for now. <laughs>